Saseni, saseni my safeguarding family around the world. I hope mko poa, mko salama. Guys, thank you for continuing to pray for our brother Ayubu and his children. Uh, of course, the current news ni akwamba dia meza kutu update. Ayubu is in the hospital at the moment. Is okay, but not really okay. Ameweza kujeruhiwa, but he's okay. The sad thing is watoto bado hawajapatikana, but uh, tunaendelea kuomba, tunajua wako watoto wako salama. Kama ayubu wako salama, we know watoto wako salama because it was all a game. You know, hata wakati mlikuwa minasikia Rudha kijifanya, I think kuna ka video liweza kurekord pale katika kachano wako nako, hata sitambia watu chano ni gani. Ilikuwa tu ni kujifanya. It was all a game. Ibu msikilize hapa ki, abile alikuwa nasema. Oh my God. Oi, mimi takufa na stress jamani. Hai. Wa, 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 wa. Napigia baba jarin simzangu wa shiki. Ni mteja, hata sijishi, da ni nini kweli. Na jaribu kupigia jay, jay, na ni ingino. Alishika maramoja, kaniambia leo ndi wanasafiri. Mimi sijui kweli kama wamesafiri ama shida ni nini kwa sababu wako niambia kama wanaenda leo aki sijui Mungu wangu nisaidie. Mimi <laughs> nitafanya nini kweli? <laughs> Watoto wangu wakienda mimi nitakufa ama nitafanya nini kweli Mungu wangu nisaidie usikubali kitu ifanyike Mungu wangu. <laughs> Mimi nimekuwa mtu mbaya kweli lakini ifiki hiyo kiwango kweli ya kuwa eti wanaenda wakaniacha Mungu wangu. <laughs> mungu hata najua nimekosa kwa uko lakini hiyo kiwango ya kufika Mungu wangu eti waniache. <laughs> Sijatarajia Mungu wangu eh. <laughs> mungu nisaidie baba we. <laughs> Nisaidia Yesu asikuwa ameniacha kweli wakaenda. Mungu nisaidie, Mungu wangu nisaidie. Watu wangu asiniache. Baba Jerry ni rudi tu kama umeenda kitafadhali. Nitabini ni wafuate mpaka huko Tanzania sijui itakuwaaje kweli kama umeenda. Aki mimi Mungu nisaidie. Sasa nitamaka ni ili nishika mimi kweli mpaka nafikia kiwango kama hicho kweli Mungu wangu. Tulishi vizuri tuna familia yangu lakini mwisho wake Mungu angalia mambo yenye imebadilika ghafla nisaidie baba nisamee yake Mungu wangu nisamee. Nirudishie familia yangu back Mungu wangu. Mungu nisaidie yake. Mimi niko na stress. Silali sikuli ya stress. Jini fanya nini? Mungu nisaidie yake. Nisaidie baba warudi. Nisaidie Mungu wangu warudi hapa familia zangu. Je, ana nini na lata kitoro zangu? Je, yake wewe unanifanyia hivyo kwa nini je? Je, unanifanyia hivyo kwa nini maji? Unataka niisha je? Unataka niisha je? Oh, Mungu nisaidie. Mungu anisaidie Mungu wangu. Ni hata kama ni kulala hapa naweza nikalala mpaka asubuhi. Ninaweza kaapa mpaka siku yenye sijui itakuwa aje. Nasia mimi. Hii yote ilikuwa ni machozi ya fisi. Uh, this woman is dangerous. Uh, it's sad ya kwamba kuna a man that is actually going to think ya kwamba Ruth anaweza kuwa wife ama hata um a potential girlfriend because this woman is dangerous kama anaweza kufanyia you know baba ya watoto wao mambo kama haya wakiwa na boniface na mama yake hawa ni watu wa kuogopwa watu kae mbali na wao so hiyo video unaona kijifanya hapo ilikuwa tu i think probably just before the holding issue happened ilikuwa ni kujaribu kufunga watu macho eh, of course wakati walijua Ayubu is on his way to Tanzania. I think they then planned everything. 
uh, and unfortunately, you know, it is what it is. But at least we are happy to know that Ayubu is doing well. Nasa our concern ni watoto tu. But of course, tunajua watoto wako salama, but tunandelea kuomba. Tunandelea kusadiki ya kuomba, all shall be well. I am going to come live shortly, so I'm not going to talk much katika hii video, but I'd like to come live shortly. So maybe just make sure your notification bell is on. I'll probably be coming live in about two hours. So, and I want to probably just talk comprehensively about the issue. Uh, of course, I cannot, hakuna kitu naeza kusema ambaye itakuja ku kwenda contrary with what Brother Jay is saying. So, but watu wa mungu, tafadhali tuendeleni kuomba. Tunasadiki ya kuomba mama yake Ruth. Believe ya ndi ya kuna watoto. And that Akua apprehended very soon. But in the meantime, let's keep praying. Let's continue to remain focused ya kuomba familia itaza kuwa pamoja very soon and uh, please do not forget to subscribe guys we are on the road to 10,000 subscribers this is the kind of um, things we do wakikisha familia wako sawa tunendelea kuomba pamoja and we keep our children safe we are praying that watoto wa ayubu wako safe and it shall be well but I'll see you again sometimes later today in a live video but until then nabakia safeguarding officer Jeff Adiós.